it's no secret 2018 just about upon us you got people who are gonna have New Year's resolutions and different things that they want to accomplish and stuff that they want to happen well hooray for you we all do it's not about being sarcastic or anything or being condescending towards anybody it's obviously clear that we know New Year is coming upon us and people have different things that they want to accomplish but it is as the saying goes the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and respecting respected expecting uh, same result, different result let me see if I can get it right the second time the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and are expecting a different result yeah I think I got it right that time you know don't judge me don't judge me it reminds me of a conversation I had with an old timer just recently I was talking about something it was an old time I respect somebody I hadn't seen in a while and he just hit me with some some real powerful wisdom or something that I was already thinking about. The old time was telling me cherish the moments you have because you never know when they're going to be gone. You know, especially your time. You know, this time that we have is precious. It was a simple concept. You know, nothing too crazy, nothing outlandish or out there. He said simply, just be more efficient with your time. So it's about effectiveness because you don't really know how much time you have. You don't know when it's going to leave. You don't know where things are going to take you. So be more efficient with you. What I equate that to is basically working smarter, not harder, even though some people may want you to work harder, you know, depending on who you work for, or who you know. Going into any year, going into any new day, I think it's about not spending time on the things that are unnecessary, the things that are only going to lead you down a dark path or to distractions. Of course, no matter how hard we try drama, gossip, intrigue with drama and gossip will take its course you know but the thing is not to focus too much on the drama on the gossip on the negativity to the point where you can't get things done i think being effective with your time is about being able to get things done in an orderly timely you know expedient fashion sometimes you may have to write stuff down make a list you know set a schedule a reminder or something on your phone an alarm you, you never also as many people have heard you know they're setting long-term goals if something is not you know done within 2018 you know or even 2019 you don't have to beat yourself up it's not the end of the world if you don't accomplish things basically in the time frame that you set just as long as you you know aim to accomplish that thing that you're trying to accomplish or do it until the work is done but i learned we get distracted we fall down we go through things in order to learn to get back up in order to learn to push ourselves through the trials and tribulations because life will probably be boring without them. While I don't have all the answers, I do, you know, encourage and challenge people and stress and strive to tell people, be more efficient with your time. Be smarter with how you do things. Don't always take the hard route. Truth be told, if you don't work smarter, you will work harder or not at all. Anyway, these are just my thoughts.